Just because we're dumbasses don't mean you can be too. So don't do any of the we do at home. Welcome back. Uh, episode 2, bracket 1, losers bracket. Tonight is all the losers from the last night. Most of the people didn't show up because they, I, I don't know what their problem is, but we got about, what was it, eight, eight to, eight to nine people for losers. But either way, even if they didn't show up, it's going to be two winners either way. So we have enough people to move on. So if they don't show up, it's their fault. The people that didn't show up are automatically out. They didn't, you know, they didn't race. So I got a list of people that, you know, that told me they wanted to come to cash days and they didn't even text me about days or anything. So they're scratched from any of my other events. And there's some people that didn't show up and they had valid reasons. So those people are cool. But the other people that didn't even tell me anything, they're out for the rest of my events if I ever host. But um, yeah, tonight we changed roads. It's the pad, but backwards. We're going to be changing every night so people don't get used to the spots. And we're just changing it up. So let's get to the pairings. All right, ladies, this is night uh, two. Yep, for the losers. You guys are the losers. Welcome to the losers bracket. How do you guys feel? How do you guys feel about being losers today? Very good. Okay. So it'll be the same thing. It'll be the same thing. There'll be two winners tonight. And there's going to be a winner's bracket and a loser's bracket. So you don't get into the winner's bracket until the final of the loser's bracket, basically. So, yeah, two will move on. The rest of you guys are sadly going to have to go home and go cry and, you know, maybe come back next year or some shit. I don't know. So that was the, we're going to, I'm going to, I'm going to have a group chat for both brackets to see what's best for everyone so we can get everyone there. So, yeah, so once, once we got the brackets ready, I'll make a group chat and we'll, we'll figure that out. So. Okay, so it's only Sold and Jacob who is here that can race. And the rest are, yeah, the rest are because their matchups are gone. If Country doesn't show up by at the end of this race, oh, he's here. Country is here. So once Country gets here, so it'll be Sold and Jacob. Bingo. What, what, what? Does Country have to be in the party to race? Um, I mean, he, he just invite him. If he doesn't join, then I don't know what to tell him, but. It's gonna be sold and Jacob first, and after that will be Country and Plumsy. And then if Axel doesn't show up by then, then it's B or it's Hicks's win. So everybody moved on because yeah, the rest were AFK. So um, there'll be no buy rounds tonight, just to, for we won't take a while. So uh, yeah, just to get J sold and Jacob up here, and then Country and Plumsy. Wait, wait, we race this way, right? First up, we got sold and Jacob. Jacob didn't show up the first night of the bracket. Sold lost to i don't i don't remember but sold lost and you know jacob didn't make it the first night so he's here he brought a hellfire the whole bracket one is hellfires if you look at it i think this is the most hellfires i've seen in a minute hellfires hasn't haven't been a big thing lately i don't know why but you know you should usually you see a lot of nobles but tonight was a lot of hellfires and you know let's see if jacob got what it takes Not gonna lie, Jacob ran a good race. He, I mean, for what I expected him, he was running good. He he launched, but I don't know if he had his clutch. It was it was clearly that Sold was a better driver tonight. So Sold moves on to next round. Jacob is sadly eliminated from Mega Cash Days. Whoever didn't show up tonight from Mega Cash Days is automatically eliminated. There's no more chances. So if you lose, you're out. Next pair is Plumsy and Country. It's funny, both of them weren't supposed to show up tonight, but I told each of them that they weren't their opponent was it and they both showed up i didn't mean to do that but they both showed up and they came to race so clumsy he's getting down the road you know he's not sleeping he's hitting good boost and he's he's getting that car down I don't know what happened with Country, but Plumsy won by one and a half. Plumsy's showing up for the team. He's showing he can run his car. It's all Hellfire bracket, so, you know, best Hellfires come out of the bracket, and Plumsy's proven he can run his car. That's the end of the first round because most of the people didn't show up, and it's fine. It's the loser's bracket. There's only two winners either way. We have enough. Next is Hicks and Warrior. Still Hellfires. Honestly, 
Warrior got far because he was racing duck. Or he he got lucky, basically not ducks. But let's see who gets it. Hicks gets out and you know warrior was sleeping they go for boost i don't know if they hit boost both of them because they looked like they were staying and they nobody moved up but hicks got it by one and a half and hicks is moving on uh warrior gotta come back maybe next year if we ever do this again but hicks is moving next on. up we got bibu and sold both pbso members it you know it sucks to see uh the same teams racing each other but it is what it is only there will only be one winner you know it's not a team race even though you would like to see your teammates move on um but it should be a good race both of them are fast two hellfires it should be a close one not gonna lie i expected bibu to win this race but sold was on the tree he hit good boost and it was it was a gap there you know it was maybe one two cars and you know it was a it was, sold ran his car i don't know what else to tell you i expected more from bibu you know i thought bibu was gonna make it back and you know it is what it is bibu's out sold moves on and uh you know it is what it is it, it surprised me plumsy and taco Plumsy's been running the hell out of his car. Taco never ran tonight, so let's see if Taco's gonna struggle or if Plumsy's gonna struggle. Either or. Plumsy moves on. He's on it tonight. Gonna, he wasn't about to make it tonight too. And, you know, he's on the tree. He's hitting good boost. Not gonna lie, Taco was pulling. I thought I thought Taco was gonna pull around him because he was coming in hard. And Plumsy stays out, so he moves on. Taco sadly is out of the out of the cash days and it's tough. It's tough. So Hicks, Sold, and Plumsy are our winners. We can only have two. We did a three-way race, which went terribly. There was a lot of reasons to rerun, but Plumsy did win all of his races, so Plumsy is automatically moving on. Sold and Hicks. Hicks won twice, but somebody talked on the line and then it lagged. And then Sold won the last one, but Hicks did miss boost, so I feel like we did cheat him out of that race. So me and OD discussed. They're going to rerun that race two out of three in bracket two, which is this Wednesday and losers brackets on Thursday. So they will run. They will run on Thursday, actually, because it's losers. They're in losers bracket. Um, bracket two is this Wednesday coming up. So if you're in bracket two, be ready for that same time. Um, but bracket one is set. We got boost Braxton and the winners and we got Plumsy in the losers. And then the winner of Hicks and sold will be also moving on to the losers bracket. So, you know. People that missed out tonight, it's on them. They lost. They didn't get a chance to race. It is what it is. You know, we only were going to take two racers either way. So even if they came and lost, it is what it is. But bracket two is coming soon. And, you know, it's good racing. So it is what it is. I'll see you guys in the next one.